Hello, my name is Jose Ojeda and I'm going to show you in this tutorial how to create a splash screen for an iOS project. So to start, we're going to create a new Xamarin Forms project. So let's go to the studio and file new solution. And for this case, I'm going to create a cross-platform application and I'm going to use the blank Xamarin Forms template. The name, you can name it whatever you want. I'm going to name this test splash. And here I'm going to use my identifier for my test application that I already registered with Apple. And we're going to use a portable class library and go ahead and we're going to use the default settings for this. We're going to wait for the application to load all the reference. And let me show you something before we proceed. This is the tutorial where Xamarin shows how to handle the launch image. It's kind of tricky because it's set up in the, the application when you start is set up in some way that you think that you have to fill these spaces because they are already filled, but it's, it's not using them. It's using the storyboard as launch screen. So it's kind of tricky. It took me a while to, to figure out how to proceed. So here, if you go to the resources, you already have this launch screen storyboard. So what you have to do is you have to go and add a new file. We're going to add a new file that I already have uh, a sample image here and we're going to copy it to the resource directory so after that we have to go here and make sure that it's a bundle resource and after that we can edit the storyboard actually I'm using a Mac so this can be done on on, on a Windows machine So in this case, uh, they have just this small logo and they set the width and height as any, the view as generic. So what I'm going to do, I'm going just to replace this. And I'm going to put this image and I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. And I'm going to change the background color to something different. And that's okay. So And we're going to run this as an iPhone 6. And there you go. 
you have the splash screen. So in the next video, I'm going to show you how to create the splash screen for the Android project. So I see you in the next video. Bye.